Hi everyone, this is Mr. Mark, and I'm going to go over basic computer troubleshooting if you run into a problem and you need to fix your computer. I just want to warn everybody that if you are working on a computer, do not open it without an adult. It is a bit dangerous to yourself and to the computer. There are hot parts of the computer inside. There are moving parts of the computer inside. And there are also there is also electricity, and, and these are not dangerous to yourself. And it is possible to short out the computer uh, if you're, you touch it the wrong way, uh, maybe uh, uh, with a piece of metal, uh, if you're trying to uh, work on the inside of it. So um, right now it's best that you don't open a computer without an adult to go into more specific training about that. So with a computer, um, you want to diagnose and solve routine hardware and software problems. And there's a really basic five-step procedure that you can use to do that. The first procedure in this chart, it shows identify the problem, gather information, analyze the information, select the best course of action, and implement and reevaluate the solution. And we're going to look at both of these, mostly for hardware, but you can try it to software problems as well. We'll start with identify the problem. And if your computer is not acting the way it's supposed to act, you should ask yourself, what is it supposed to do? What should the computer do? And then you try to figure out what is the computer system actually doing? Is the display supposed to work, but it's not working? Is the sound supposed to work and it's not working? So what should the computer do? Identify the problem. The next part is to gather information. And you do this visually, it's the easiest way. Or if it's a sound system, you do it listening. So check your inputs. Is the keyboard plugged up? Is the mouse plugged up? Is the microphones plugged up? And then check your outputs, you know, the display. Is it is the cable loose? Uh, is the audio plugged into the wrong jack? Um, is your printer hooked up to your USB port or however you print? And then um, sometimes your external storage, uh, it might not be pushed into the USB slot all the way. And then you might want to check software settings. If, if you're supposed to enable something by uh, checking a box somewhere in your settings menu. Sometimes that happens too. And then you analyze the information. What would make the computer do what it's currently doing? And how can I make the computer work properly? How can I make the display work? Now, this could be simple, like, simple as the, the cables loose in the back of the computer for the uh, display. So you just check it, push on it, see if the display works. Or check your sound settings. Is your jack plugged up right? Uh, if I plug it up right, uh, then it might work correctly. Don't waste too much time trying to overthink it, uh, but be safe about it. Uh, make a decision on what you want to do, and then just do it. And that's basically it. Uh, if you have any questions, please ask them, and I will try to answer them. If I can't find an answer, I will find somebody that does. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.